But New Lou Marketplace had its grand opening today with more than 90% of that venue filled with small and local businesses. Tonight, Gabra Gagadis shows us what visitors can expect. The majority of the folks are local, they are small businesses, entrepreneurs, they startups. The vision of using old buildings to bring new life to Nulu started two years ago. I think this is going to be one of the premier redevelopments in the entire country. It already is, but as people start seeing what's going on here, it's like this was a hard project. Even in a pandemic, developer Mo Den Jun remained persistent. Every day and every night, the you have got to eat and breathe here to make sure this thing happens. As protesters called for racial equity in one of Louisville's most popular business community, Andre Wilson, the chair of Nulu Diversity Empowerment Council, took action. So we've been doing um, diversity trainings, talking about microaggressions, what is gentrification. Six months ago, Nulu had only one black owned business. Today, it has four. Probably, I would say, by the time you get into the fall with our business incubator, we'll be looking at about 15 to 20. The marketplace offers food, bars, fashion, art, speakeasy, office space, and even Airbnb rentals. The goal is to bring more people as Nulu continues to grow. We're a place where it's community driven, where everybody's welcome. Uh, everybody can find a place that they want to eat or drink or relax. Some of the businesses opened months ago, while others opened in April. Yeah, we've been looking actually for the right space here in Louisville for over five years, uh, and we looked at, I mean, buildings all around the town. Melissa Huff opened her spot just a week before the pandemic shut things down. It was challenging. <laughs> And then just being brand new, I was like, oh my gosh, what's going to happen? Things aren't happening as quickly as we thought they would. But finally, now that everything's opening up in the marketplace and things are picking up on the Main Street side, um, things are a lot better. To start bringing more foot traffic here, starting this weekend, every second Saturday of this month, Nulu Marketplace will host live music. We'll post that information on whs11.com. For now reporting, I'm Sanai Gabriel